It's that time of year again, guys, where we all come together and pick game of the year. I won't lie, this year has been pretty crazy Whoa! for games. Also, they're kind of getting more and more expensive. Like, jeez, 60, 70, 100? Can y'all, can y'all chill? And if Sonic X Shadow Generations is not on this list, I'm crashing out. Let's start at the bottoms. Best eSports game? I'm not gonna lie. All these games are kinda trash. <laughs> I am never playing League of Legends, nor the mobile version. I tried Counter-Strike, that was kind of yes! fun. Content creator of the year, Pico is up here? I don't know any of these people. I know Queso, he's pretty funny. Hey, how, co how come I'm not up here? Where's my channel? <laughs> what one day? I'm gonna go queso. Most anticipated game. You guys already know who this, you know, belongs to. As much as I love Metroid and Monster Hunter, this is a Grand Theft Auto lobby. You're basically saying who was hyped for Grand Theft Auto. Even I'm excited to see what they're gonna do. Best adaptation. I heard mixed things about this. I heard this was actually pretty good. But I've heard really, really good things about the League of Legends Arcane. Even though I hate League of Legends, this show looks pretty good. Best multiplayer though. We got a multiplayer. Mario game up here? I did play Helldivers, and I have to say, Helldivers at its peak was actually kind of fire. And that's the only one I play. Best racing and sports games. Oh! Best strategy. I'm gonna give it to Unicorn Overload. It's basically like a Fire Emblem game. I kind of want to try it, but I I I'm waiting for it to go on deal, man, because uh, I don't want to pay full price. Oh! <laughs> I want to play this game. Apparently, it's a solid Mario like game. Princess Peach, I heard this game is kind of mid. Mario Jambo, it is a family game. You can play with the whole family. Astro Bot, best fighting game. This needs no introductions. Well, hold on a second. What the heck is Street Fighter? Dang, Street Fighter got done yeah. dirty. This, 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 it's sparking zero. Best RPG, I played Dragon's Dogma and this game was such a letdown. Oh what God. the heck happened? Bro, what did they do? I remember seeing the trailers for this game and it looks so hype. And they made these two kids look so important, but they do nothing. Elden Ring, I heard that the DLC was actually pretty clean. This might be a hot take i don't think the shadow of the urge should even be here it's dlc this should be like a tiny dlc section like best dlc of the year that's just my opinion Ooh, final fantasy birthright i finished this game and it was a solid experience i liked it i barely had any complaints with this game oh but metaphor though i just started this game and so far i like it i really really like it the first tough one just because i haven't finished metaphor yet i'm gonna give it to final fantasy best action adventure eh, astrobot best action game this right here is a battle between black myth wukong and Stellar Blade. I've heard the music in this game is clean, but you know what the crazy thing is? I've never seen anyone actually play this game. Is this game, did the game do good? Is it like a Nier? I, I, I like a Nier. I'm giving it to Black Myth Wukong because I've seen gameplay of that and it looks fun. VR game. <laughs> Super hot does look kind of fun though. Do people really be getting scared in VR? <laughs> I'll, I'll go with Batman. Mobile game. <laughs> Best indie game? I don't know. I haven't played any of these games. Plucky. Best independent game. Hey, hold on a second. Where the heck is Mouthwash? Mouthwash isn't here? Aw, oh, man. Best community support game? It's No Man's Sky. They are still giving new content to that game. You guys can stop though, you know? Like, y'all have been supporting this game for years. Best ongoing game? Fortnite. Best performance? Who is this again? Oh, she's Aerith. Okay, she got it. Best score in music. Ooh, this is a battle between these two. The music in Final Fantasy was good, but I just started this game and the battle music alone. Yo, yo, yo! So ah! Yeah, it's metaphor. Best art direction? It's either Shadow of the Earth Tree or Astro Bot. But bro, Elden Ring won like two years ago. I want to vote for a new game, in my opinion. Astro Bot. Best narrative. I just started Metaphor, but I think this game is going to be better than Rebirth. Let's be real. Rebirth is only half of the full game, you know? And I don't want to spoil anything about this game, but it's like, it's just a lot of like, we have to follow Sephiroth. That's the entire game. The story could have used more work. Maybe the third game will be better, but I'm going to go with Metaphor. I can really tell the game's going to be pretty good. Best game direction? Final Fantasy. Here it is, man. Game of the year. Recognizing a game that delivers the absolute best experience across all creative and technical fields. So basically, it's just the best of the best. Hey, my boy Astro Bot made it up here. Dang, it's really game of the year worthy. That's impressive. Wait, hold on a second. I just realized something. Where the heck is Sonic X Child Generation? <laughs> oh! 
Did you think that game doesn't deserve to be up here? Shadow Generations was a good game, but yeah, it's not game of the year worthy. But dang, not a single award for Shadow? It's not this game. Oh, I just realized something. There's no Nintendo game up here. Dang, sorry, Nintendo. What, what even is this game, actually? Is this the game that I think it is with the animals that shoot each other? What the heck? This is not the game that I thought it was. <laughs> well, maybe it's good, but nah. Now nah, you're done. Shout out the Earth Tree, bro. You had your fun two years ago. Astrobot, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. And now there were three. Black Myth Wukong, Final Fantasy, Metaphor. This may offend some people, I'm gonna say it. I think Metaphor is out of here. <laughs> Why? I think the casuals are gonna pick Final Fantasy or Black Myth Wukong. I haven't really finished this game. It's a turn-based game. And turn-based games aren't bad, but it kind of lacks the freedom. You know what I'm trying to say? Who knows? Maybe I'll change my opinion when I beat the game. But for now, it's these two. This is tough. This is really tough. The answer is kind of simple for me because it's the only game I played and that's Final Fantasy. Yeah, I think it's Game of the Year worthy. The cutscenes and the music and the story, it was pretty good. The story could have used a bit more work in my opinion. I think this is gonna be Game of the Year worthy, man. It may win. Either this or Black Myth Wukong. Metaphor's gonna be third. And just like that, man, we're done. Final Fantasy VII Rebirth is Game of the Year. You guys disagree? You guys agree? What do you guys think, man? I think I'm pretty spot on. I'm your boy Gozen. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.